right, uh, we have some breaking news coming in and uh, bail has been granted to suspended police officer Sachin Vaze in the ED money laundering case. Sachin Vaze to remain in jail, however, as he is in judicial custody in other cases. Shivani joins us live on the broadcast for more uh, Shivani. This comes as a partial relief for uh, Sachin Vaze while he's received bail in one case. However, he will continue to remain behind bars in the other case. Uh, well, yes, we are witnessing already that how there have been consecutive efforts being made by the central agencies to probe the matter of money laundering and keep Sachin Vaze behind the bars because it was him who had initially transferred that money. He was the one who had worked upon the instructions of uh, then a uh, Home Minister of Maharashtra, Anil Deshmukh. And that is why in the ED registered case, Sachin Vaze has been granted bail, though he will be staying behind the bars in the judicial custody in another case, which is being probed by National Investigation Agency, that is NIE. So definitely Sachin Vaze had filed a bail application under the section 88 of CRPC. But uh, uh, understanding the fact at the moment that Sachin Vaze has got relief from one case, but still uh, the trouble has not got over for him. And that is why behind for the NIA particular judicial custody, he will still remain behind the bars. Though Sachin Vaze will also be applying for another bail application with regards to the NIA a probe that is undergoing on the grounds of the ED money laundering case that he has been granted bail upon. Though matter will be uh, interesting to see whether the NIA special court grants him the bail on the uh, ground uh, in which uh, the case has given him some relief. All right, uh, Shivani, thank you so much for getting us those details.